Yo, 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 hey guys, it's poppin'. Jock Slade here, back with another unboxing. And as you can tell today, I've got a big one. That was a terrible drum roll, let's try that again. Yes, uh, I have no idea what is in here. I do know that it's heavy, um, and I believe it's from Nike, but I'm not absolutely sure. It didn't say Nike on the packaging, um, but I know Nike released a really big, big shoe this week, and I'm hoping, I'm really hoping that that is what is in here. So without further ado, let's uh, get into this. So one, we can get this big giant box off of the table so uh, you can actually see what's in here. Uh, this is a shoe that many of you have seen before if it is what I think it is. Uh, I could be totally wrong and I'm calling some other brand's shoe a Nike shoe, but I don't know. First thing you see, there's a lot of uh, go <laughs> and it hits the shoe. Oh my gosh. You guys are gonna love this. Hold on. Let me, <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> I love this. I'm so excited about this. All right, so, ah, here we go. All right, so before I get into this, there are some things that you should know. Back in the 1990s, Nike designers had a marketing directive to create a shoe that was comfortable. And that was the main thing. They needed a shoe that was comfortable, that not the hype crowd, not the sneaker heads, not the, the athletes, but a shoe that was comfortable that anyone could wear at any time and it would work. That shoe, my friends, my people of the internet, turned out to be the Nike Air Monarch. Now, before you flip away, before you turn away, just listen because the story gets better from there. From there, designer Jason Maiden, who worked at Jordan, worked on the Nike Air Monarch 2 in the 2000s. So this shoe has been coming out since the early 90s, or late 90s, I should say, and it has constantly been one of the best-selling shoes that Nike creates. And the shoe is at almost any store that you go to that sells Nikes and your dads and all of them wear them. So don't be mad at them. But the, the shoe is actually getting a little more love. People are starting to actually wear the shoe a little more. There's been a few like designer and collabs on the shoe. And my thought is that if Nike updates the model to the Nike Air Monarch 5, because we are on the Monarch 4, um, that it's going to be a bigger deal than it has ever, ever been because people are kind of into it and the dad shoe trend is a big thing and that's been sort of on people's minds. So just thought I'd mention that. So let's get in here. Uh, they sent me a special edition package for this shoe, which looks really, really dope. So check that out. That is very cool. Uh, so cool thing about this is they went with like the classic cooler style. So this is like with the metal upper, you know, the old ones that you used to get with like the metal handles. So it has the Coleman here on the side. It's the Coleman cooler. It has Camp 2018 Air Monarch there at the top. And then it has the Nike swoosh right there. Uh, this one looks like it got dented. I imagine that was dented in transit. But let's take a look inside. So I'll do this to you guys so you guys can see. Let's it. it has like the old school like metal lock on there. And then you open it up and it says 1972. All right, what's in here? So there is a, <laughs> there's a Camp 2018 Nike Air Monarch hat right there with the uh, Velcro on the top. That is pretty cool. And then there is, looks like there's a note here. Uh, says, it's Father's Day. If Father's Day had a signature shoe, it would be the Nike Air Monarch 4 to honor the sneakers origins and to celebrate the joys of summers spent outdoors, Nike is releasing the Air Monarch 4 Weekend Campout. In advance of the shoe's official release, we're sending you a pair, no campout required. The limited edition Air Monarch 4 Weekend Campout features design elements that celebrate time-honored traditions shared by fathers and their children, such as, such as camping. Stay fresh this Father's Day, Nike Camp Monarch. So these shoes actually released already. I wasn't in town. I was out of town when this package came. And these shoes released on June 11th on sneakers. And then I believe they're released on Nike.com on the 14th. But there's going to be a, a Japan release, I believe, in July. So if you have a Japan Connect, you'll be able to get yourself a pair. But 
This is obviously a special edition package. You can see it says the 1972 there. And then there's some uh, beverage containers. Uh, so if you have a beverage that your dad wants to hold, he can put them in here. This one says Camp 2018. Uh, 1972 on that one that goes to switched on the hat and then another blue one for the camp air monarch with the camping sign and then another beverage container uh, so if you want to switch it out and you want to rock with the blue with the blue one right there you could throw that on there this is like a dad's dream pack so for your father's day if you weren't able to get a pair or if you want to get your dad a pair on resale then you can but let's look at the creme de la creme the prize and all of this the Nike Air Monarch 4. Uh, and this came with, it looks like a, a hard case on the inside that has Air Monarch. I'll show you guys that. You can see that right there inside where it just says Air Monarch. It's like a hard case there. So let's put this on the ground. All right. Let's also put this stuff on the ground and get a good look at the shoe. Now, again, this is a limited edition pair. These are inspired by the great outdoors, by the camp out. So they have some camp out and great outdoors sort of details. As you can tell, the olive green, which I imagine is inspired by trees and the great outdoors. They have a nice leather upper. They have a sort of like carpet plush sort of Nike swoosh. So this reminds me of like those old vans from the 70s that had carpet inside of them. I glitch with eyes, I will, goes with the whole 1972 theme. Have a little bit of red. This one has a custom patch. It says Camp Monarch 2018 right there. And then this one also has a custom patch uh, with the, the red. And then it also has a 1972 with that same sort of carpet sort of feel. I mean, maybe it's called shag carpet. I think that's what it's called. So it has like the shag swoosh and then the shag carpet here on uh, the Nike swoosh. They went with green rope laces, which is very nice. Just not something you think to add to this shoe. And then they have the Camp Air Monarch 2018 insoles in the blue here. Now, generally when you see these shoes, they are on the discount rack and they go for like 40, maybe 50 bucks. They have them in a white and blue colorway. They have a black colorway and I believe they have a black and red or the bread Air Monarch 4 colorway. And basically it's the dad shoe. It's the dad shoe. It's the shoe that dads wear whenever they're at the mall, whenever they're going anywhere, whenever there's a barbecue, whenever there's anything basically where they don't have to wear hard bottoms. You usually see dads rocking in an air monarch it comes in at different widths which works because a lot of you know dads have bigger feet guys have bigger feet like generally they want a bigger wider shoe and so this is the shoe that they wear I actually have a couple people in my family that actually rock the monarchs exclusively um, when it comes to their tennis shoe game which is perfectly fine it's a definitely a comfortable shoe I've worn a pair just to see how comfortable they are so it definitely works now these again these are limited and this pair in particular isn't available anymore so if you wanted this nice gum bottom with the navy blue and then the red hits with the pivot point or you wanted the full length air you unfortunately will not be able to get this colorway of the shoe because they are sold out right now I uh, checked for these on sneakers and yeah they're so <laughs> they're sold out which is not something I ever thought I would say about the Nike Air Monarch but if this is your thing and you wanted the limited edition version you wanted to hook your dad up you might be able to go to on one of those reseller sites and get your dad a pair, uh, letting him know that he has something exclusive. Can you imagine taking your dad somewhere, rocking these, and he having shoes just as exclusive as everyone else someone has on maybe they have like on the supreme jordans or they have like on the dornbecker jordans or maybe they have on the off-white vapor max or the off-white prestos or they have on like vapor max or they have just some sort of random the new nike reacts maybe they have the react element 87 and they think they're cool because they have super exclusive shoes and then your dad pulls up steps out and he's wearing the camp out monarchs that would be incredible. And I would love to see what people actually recognize these and know that this is an exclusive shoe and just not the regular Air Monarch, that they see that these actually have some details and some quality put into them. It's just amazing to me that a shoe that looks like this, which is not something that I would typically wear, uh, just sells so well. And it goes to show you that our crowd 
the hype beast crowd because that's really who we are the sneakerhead crowd that we have different tastes and that we're not the only ones that are pushing the needle if this shoe is one of the best sellers for nike imagine how much money they're making off of the shoe in addition to all of the jordans and all of the nike shoes that we're buying because we like the hype stuff anyway that being said let's quick take a quick look at what was inside the nike camp out this is a limited edition package it is this shoe the air monarch 4 camp out with the camp out details there was the patches there was the beverage holders or the uh, the holders to keep the drink cold there was the hat the, the dad hat obviously why not do that with a dad hat because it perfectly fits in red with the movable patches and then the really cool nike coleman collab cooler um which is these are probably this i imagine is just as exclusive as these shoes because i don't know anyone that has a nike coleman cooler or the cap out monarchs anyway with that being said just thought i'd give you guys a quick look make sure you like favorite and subscribe and all that good stuff and uh maybe i'll rock these on father's day all right with that being said i'll see you soon peace guys